Welcome to the WaterWise course. Greetings, I'm Explorer Dan, and this is my plane I use to explore and learn. After completing this course, you will be able to identify the four parts of the water cycle. They are evaporation, condensation, precipitation, and collection. The sun heats up water in rivers and lakes and turns it into water vapor or steam. The water vapor or steam leaves the river, lake, or ocean and goes into the air. This is called evaporation. Water vapor in the air gets cold and changes back into liquid to form clouds. This is condensation. When the clouds get big and heavy with water, they fall back to earth in the form of rain, hail, snow, or sleet. These are all known as precipitation. Collection is precipitation collected in oceans, rivers, lakes, and streams. Evaporation, condensation, precipitation, and collection together form the water cycle. Let's try out an activity now. When you see the phase of a cycle appear, drag the plane to the correct action on the page. Drag the plane to condensation. That's right. Good job. Drag the plane to collection. That's right. Good job. Drag the plane to evaporation. That's right. Good job. Drag the plane to precipitation. Great job. Now you know the four phases of the water cycle. Click to drag each image to complete the cycle. You will be able to move them around until the cycle is completed correctly. You will be notified once you completed it correctly. You got it. You got it. You got it. You got it. Match the cycle phase to its definition by dragging the numbers to its definition. A line will appear if the match is correct. Collection. Correct. Happens when water from clouds enters the bodies of water. Condensation. Correct. Happens when the vapor in the air gets cold and changes back to liquid, forming clouds. Precipitation. Correct. Happens when enough water has condensed in the form of clouds that air cannot hold anymore. Evaporation. Correct. Happens when the sun heats up the Earth's bodies of water and creates vapor. Congratulations. You have successfully completed the WaterWise course. You will now be able to identify the four parts of the water cycle. Evaporation, condensation, precipitation, and collection.